In this video, Colin's going to be showing you guys the essential apps that you need for your Shopify store. There's millions of apps out there in the Shopify app store. So it took us years to find out the ones that actually lead to increase in sales and we'll be giving it all to you guys today on this video. So be sure to give Colin a follow, shoot him a DM, do the same for me. I'm open to answer any questions. I've been making it a routine to reply to every single DM. So be sure to hit us up in our Instagram DM. And if you want further one-on-one -on -one consulting, be sure to hit us up. Hey guys, what's going on? So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to um, set up the apps for your store. So think of the apps like the iPhone apps, if you have them, or Android apps, right? Um, I'm gonna visit the app stores and I'm gonna go ahead and download all the crucial apps that I think you need, all right? So the first one, we're just gonna go in alphabetical order. We're going to Ali Reviews. And this basically allows your site to have um, reviews. You know how Amazon how, has reviews? This app will allow you to have reviews. So we're gonna get this app. Now note, I wanna make a, 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 a distinction here that um, these will be trial periods and uh, some of them will cost money. So, you know, use them as your discretion, but I recommend people who take this course, you have some sort of income, right? So we're gonna go with the free plan at first and it limits us to 10 products only, but um, you know, we'll be okay with 10 products for now. So that's all you need. So we're in this video, we're just gonna focus on, you know, the setup process and and just downloading the apps. Um, how to use it, we, we might briefly go over that, but um, you know, it, it's it, honestly, most of these apps are really self-explanatory. All you would do is, you know, when you get the app, you would just, you would, it would show up over here and then you would basically, uh, it would say like get reviews, okay? But since we don't have one um, in the uploading video, when we upload products, I'll show you how to do the reviews. So boom. There we go, we got our first apps. Let's see, let's reload this and see if it shows up. All right, so boom. Now we're gonna get our next app. Um, this one's gonna also be like uh, Amazon. You, every, if you notice Amazon, you'll know that on the bottom section, they'll have you know recently uh, or recommended items. So we're gonna use this. This one's gonna cost a little bit, $10, but the trial's for a whole month. So, I mean, I'm sure, I'm, if you put in the work, I guarantee you, you'll make way over $10 uh, within 30 days. It, it's almost impossible not to. So, don't worry about this. It's, it's really not much of a cost at all. So, they're gonna, 30 day trial is huge. It's like really long. Um, I've definitely gotten sales off of this app. You'll make more money just from this app than that ten dollars that you spent easy so it it helps your conversion um so yeah that's our second app also bought basically what it does is um like i said amazon will have that bottom section and installation was successful basically here's how you use it really fast you would um you would explore recommendations now we don't have a product right now, but we would select our product and then we would add related products. So let's say you sold, you sold um, shoes. You, you might, in the recommended section, it might sell laces, you might sell socks, you might sell shoe cleaning um, stuff, you know, spray or whatever, right? That's how you would do it, right? So that way when they scroll through your product page, they see the recommended items. All right, so the next app. Free trial, awesome. The next one is going to be an app that allows you, so in, so this app is interesting. So this one's gonna be 30 days but $5. So yeah, that's nothing. So really you wanna budget probably $100 a month for these apps because that's probably what it might come down to. Um, maybe starting off, maybe only $50 but you know, you really want to budget that. So this app basically coined by ShopPad, this app is for um, converting uh, currencies. So currencies, you know, if someone goes on your page and they're from India, right? It's like rupees, right? Or they're from the UK and they're pounds, right? 
or they're from um, you know or it's euros or or uh, pesos or whatever it is this this thing will go from dollars to that currency so that way it's not confusing that way they aren't like trying to um, you know convert currencies manually they'll see what it costs in pesos or they'll see what it costs in pounds um, one second we are going to round this conversion So basically, these are all the the ones. Um, you can select all of them, honestly, but um, these are the main ones. Um, yeah, we'll leave it at this for now. Um, you can <laughs> Bitcoin. That'd be funny. Chinese. Yeah, so this is really all you need for now because these are the main currencies and we just want to save changes, okay? So if you want, if you were to change your location um, or if you have a, you know, in your computer, your um, whichever browser you use, it would show up, you know, as that different um, currency. Okay, so that's coin by shop pad, okay? We are going to do Oberlow, all right? So Oberlo um, is an app that allows you to fulfill orders. So after you get sales, you can uh, fulfill the orders using Oberlo. What it also does, it allows you to import products, right? I personally use Dropified, um, but for this purposes, uh, Oberlo is free. So we're gonna download Oberlo. You might have seen ads on this. You know, this is a really popular one. Um, when you get the money, I recommend using Dropified because of the fact that Dropified allows you to use multiple suppliers. Um, it's just a lot faster with ordering. Um, and yes, so you want to use Dropified. Um, but Oberlo still works for now, so we're gonna we're gonna download that app. Next one we're gonna do is order lookup. Basically, this will connect your order's fulfillment status into um, a place where uh, they can, so customers can look up their orders. So let's say they want to know where the shipment is at, then um, they can go onto your website and all they have to do is just look up your orders and it's connected. So $10 a month, um, 70 free trial, all right? So, this is pretty important. Uh, it helps your customer service quite a bit. So, you know, anytime someone has a question about the order, you just say, hey, go onto our website, uh, click on track my order, and you can track your order there. So it's gonna be on your home page as well. So very easy for customers to find. So a lot of people, you know, a lot of courses, they'll go very in depth with these apps. And I really don't think it's necessary. Like I said, you can, there's tons of tutorials that would do a better job than I would. Um, we just wanna make sure everything's correctly used. So yes, we wanna look up by email. So we wanna put this email here for our plant planet store at gmail.com so put your store there everything else is pretty self-explanatory you don't need it that's all we need to do save alrighty so So they're just importing the orders, which there are no orders anyway. Um, so this is how you install it, they're showing you. Basically, you wanna create a menu and then add it. 
So order lookup page. All right, so we're gonna go to pages. Um, where is it here? I believe we're gonna go pages, and then we're gonna add the. We're gonna say um, track track your order. Right here, we're gonna go track your order. I think that's it. I don't think we need to do anything yet. So we're gonna save it, and then we're gonna go navigation. So this is how to connect the app, and. Um, and obviously add this page to your uh, your home page so that they can find it. So add menu, then we're gonna go to um, pages, link order lookup, there we go. But the name of it, we're gonna say track your order, boom. We're gonna save it. Now let's go ahead and go to, to our site just to tour our planet. Let's just see how it looks like see if it works properly boom track your order see so we don't have any orders so it's not gonna work well but we're gonna put in the email address or and the order number or actually we can look up with email only let's say you have an order okay you place the order on Oberlo and then Oberlo as soon as it's shipped you'll mark this as fulfilled and when it's fulfilled it's gonna connect that as uh, it's gonna you when you mark it as fulfilled it's gonna have a tracking number in your orders and then what order lookup does is it automatically tracks the order number so that um, it tells the customer you know if it's been shipped or not or or where the status is so that's how it tracks it basically you have to you have to make sure that the tracking number is set into these orders so that the order lookup can uh, look it up for your customer okay and what I like about this course that I'm making is that I'm literally showing you pretty much all the apps that I use right most people will just share a few apps you know and they'll try to uh, they'll try to go in depth but they really don't show you every single app that you need or a lot of people, the mistake that they make is that they'll have too much apps. The problem with too much apps is it just kind of slows down your page, number one. Number two is you're just it's just unnecessary. You just want the apps that are essential, all right? Um, next, we are going to do, um, I'm trying to think which, we can do uh, upsell bundles. So this one is very essential. And this one will might make you the most money out of all of them. All right. So upsell bundles, what it does is it basically gives you an option under the add to cart um, somewhere in your product page. And let's say let's say you're selling shoes. Well, you can pair the socks and the shoes. So if they buy both the socks and the shoes, they get X percentage off or they get this, right? So this is important because it really incentivizes people to um, buy something else. And since you have good margins, assuming that you price it out well, your pricing is good, then you're gonna make money. I personally, when I do these upsell bundles, um, I do 25% off. And people say, well, that's too high. But when people just see 10% off, they're like, oh, what's the point, you know? I've tested it out and personally, you know, 25% uh, off has worked actually really well for me. So um, I don't know what's going on with uh, this app. Sometimes there might be some bugs in the app or something like that. Um, so for now, let's skip over it because um, we will use this app though. It's just, uh, I don't know what's going on with it. So so what I'll do is, I'll, these are the essential apps that you will have in your store. So these are the ones that are very low budget that you should be able to afford. If you have this course, you can afford this. 